testing, testing, one, two, three. Mac Music 63 back in a building. And I can't even really say back because it's been so long since I've legit uploaded something on this channel. But I mean, every producer goes through this. Every artist goes through this music wise. You go through this from time to time again. Hold on, let me move my mic a little closer, bro. I'm wilding. But you go through this from time to time again. You kind of lose passion, you lose the drive, and you lose the inspiration. So I just had to wait. I wasn't going to force it because if I forced it, I don't think it would have been good. Wouldn't have been worth uploading. Wouldn't have been none of that. So, I mean, I've been putting out certain kind of beats and stuff, but I mean, at the same time, I just lost my passion. But now I'm feeling good and I legit had something to make a video, video, video about on the music channel. So today we finna be going over the, I don't know if it's new. I just know I just got it because I use RK a lot and RK has gotten better through over time. RK has became a great plugin to use a, well, a great vst to use but now we using studio by i believe studio linked they say it got sounds from zay tovin scott storch and those are amazing producers amazing producers so we finna go through it right now and see what's to this basically see what's to it i don't really know how anything goes so they got okay so this is my content they got abstract elements drop the sounds to one of the layers okay you drag and drop the sound to a layer and and what we do what we do out one of the layers okay i dropped it here click from the sounds list oh oh okay 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 uh take that off click the sounds list oh you press play <laughs> Okay. Okay, and then you drag the sound here. Boom. Oh, you could chop it up? Let's see, let's look at the effects. What can we do? You could, you could put a filter, you put a delay, reverb. Okay, phaser. What's the output? You could change how it hit. Mmm. No pattern, just a source. Okay. I like that. I like that. I like that. Uh, what about this one? How this one sound? Hold on. This is, this is just abstract elements. Let's go to let's go to the piano. Let's go 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 to the, go to the piano. What are you doing? Get get that off of there. Um, I get it. Abstract element. I get it. Take all, oh, all. Oh. So you gotta click again to take them all. And when you don't have anything selected, it selects all. Gotcha. Hold on, I gotta hook in my keyboard. Well, my MIDI keyboard. Not just keyboard. I hook in my MIDI keyboard for this, so I can see how stuff sound. But well, these are, are all of these like, like this isn't just the keyboard. These are melodies and stuff. not really a lot it's loops it's loops okay that's a note a note oh i like that i likes that i likes that put that put that put that can you switch this like what, what it hits at? Huh, okay. That's not bad. Hold on, let's hook the MIDI keyboard in. See what's to this, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, sweet word. Yeah, sweet word. Whoa. Um, yeah, no open. You as a B port on this joint. Hold on. <laughs> we don't have an open USB port. What's this for? Oh, okay, okay. I can use this. One. Yeah, yeah, we can use this one right here. Jeez, I was finna say. I don't know. There we go. Okay. 
Okay, so I want to I wanna be able to use it here. So drag it here and let that be the first note. That's not bad. Hold on. I like this. Okay, so how does let's see how does that work with how does that work with the loops? Oh, that's a vibe. That's a vibe. Hold on, bro. I think I like it right here every time. So is it a different note every time? Okay. It actually speeds up too. So, so that changes the melody. Well, it doesn't change the melody like the BPM. Really, it changes the BPM of it. Let's see. We just run through these. I mean, the p ain't nothing too crazy about the pianos, though. Let's see. Afro B. Jeez. I mean, that go, that go hard, I guess. <laughs> okay. I think it, up, uh, it adds more sounds over time as well. So does it, um, they got pads. I want to, I want to see if they have them single, like by themselves. Okay. Uh, okay. Can it stop now? Like, gee, they're all loops in here in the Afro B joint. It's all loops. Okay. Um, ambient pads. Okay. Feel gross. I don't like that. Yeah. Ugh. It's not bad. Mm. It's not bad. Oh, wait, it didn't start from the top. Yeah, these pads are gross. I mean, you're talking about $10 a month right here. Oh, no, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. I don't know. See the brass. There's no kind of brass in here. But let's just see. What's the quality of it? Yeah. Jesus, that's gross. It's not bad. Yeah, that is heat. That, that's decent. Mm. That's not bad, low key. I ain't gonna hold. Don't mess with these brasses. with the brasses bro the brasses was decent it was decent yeah yeah i mean i'm a, I'm a sucker for voices yeah. it don't really matter what they are da, 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 da. what what happens da, 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 da. click them like that like what did i just do put it over here oh you could save a preset Let's see. Let's say layers. Will they put it all together if I do? Da, 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 yeah. Let's just see. If I happen to put all of them there in different slots, like what would it do? Oh, so you give it all something separately? Let's see. If I cross over, will it play them all? Yeah. 
Yeah, play them both. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, play them both. If I happen to do that. Or you could just set them up on your keyboard. That's decent. I like that. That's nice. You can have it on your whole little joint setup. I like that. That's decent. Those voices was okay. Oh, hold on now. Hold on now. What's name got a drip too? What's this drip? Okay. What's that away? Okay, now 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 we getting somewhere. Now now we getting somewhere. I mean, I got my favorite 808s already. Every every producer has the, has their favorite sounds. Like they have their favorite sounds in their own area, so they ain't gotta search too far for it. Like every producer has that. I mean, do we do we need to just make a beat with this right now? Is that do that is that what we need to do? I feel like that's what we need to do right now. I feel like we need to just make a beat. You know? Okay. You know what? I want to see... I want to see how much I can manipulate a sample. So load that in. Let's see. How much can I manipulate this? Hold on. Put it right here. It changed the tempo right here. Okay, you can scroll. You can scroll and change that. Okay. You can change the pitch. You can change all of this. Hold on. Okay, um, we change the key? Hold on. What? Can we change the key for real? Oh, we can't change the key. Oh, they sold for that one. I should be able to change the key. Reverse. Reverse it, okay. To loop it, I can sync. Hmm. Okay. How much can I manipulate this, bro? I know you. I know you can put the reverb and stuff on it, but like, can I chop it? Can I? Um, instruments. Hmm. Got bass, key, lead. Uh, presets drum I want to say when they will put on here okay I think this is relatively new too by the way I think this is relatively new oh you can snatch a MIDI file let's see can I drag this MIDI into here no you can't drag that MIDI into there but let's let's what what, what can we do what what hold on hold on Pattern. Um, can I play it? You could. Oh, whoa! Hold on. So you could do that on here, then. Pattern. Hold on. Okay. Okay. Clear. Clear everything out. Just clear everything out. We have a MIDI file. So this MIDI file. Attack Metro Boom. Okay. Whatever. So, hold on. So let's say we get a kick. I want to assume uh, it's a metro booming pattern or something. So we're going to put that on the kick. And now. Oh. Oh, okay. And you can change you could change how far it stretches as well. Um, that might be eight oh eight then. 
What's this? Let's see. Put it as 808. Or can I just, just, just disable it? Hold on. Can I just, just disable it? Can I just disable it? It's irritating. Constantly stretching them out. What did I just do? I don't know what I just did. I think. Okay, the first one you click. They got middies. This database is this this is loaded. This is loaded. This is full of stuff. Honestly, I I, I don't even have enough like it it'll take me forever. I don't have enough time to go through all of this. So what I'm gonna do is Jesus. Ten dollars a month. We're talking ten dollars a month. And with that ten dollars, you getting samples, midis, sounds new ones added throughout the month it's definitely worth it it's definitely worth it if you're somebody like me that gets tired of using the same old sounds and you maybe need a loop for some inspiration or something to chop up or maybe a midi file to send you on your way to making more and more beats then this bro this in arcade because i've really been feeling arcade lately but this right here is art like arcade 2.0 like sheesh it's so much that I got to dig into to give y'all a thorough, thorough review. But right now, this is a first impression. I'm loving everything about it. The manipulation, everything. I'm loving everything. And the fact that you get middies, and you, this is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. But be sure to like and subscribe. I got more videos on the way. Let me know if y'all got this plug in, how y'all feel about it. But yeah, I'm loving it right now. Be sure to like and subscribe. I'm out. Peace.